Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil and this is our 10th video on React with Progressive Web App. So in this video, we will check that uh, how we can just run this website on a mobile Chrome browser and how it is working on a Chrome browser. And second thing, as you know, Progressive Web App have a special feature that when we are using it on the mobile, then they can be behave like a mobile native application. They can be installed and they can be just work like normal mobile application and you cannot find the difference between uh, progressive web app and the normal mobile application so we have to check that this feature is working or not in mobile because we written all the code for uh, progressive web app right as i know that this is not an advanced level this is on the basic level but still it should work right so now let's see is it working or not but for that we actually need a mobile device and we are recording the computer screen for tutorial but we cannot uh, show the actual mobile here right so how we can do it and for that i am just going to recommend you to download the android studio because when you're just working with the progressive web app you have to check it on the mobile also so uh, all the all time you cannot just install it and you can check it on the your mobile so that you need a virtual device which is here and this is uh, just come with the android studio when just uh, install the android studio you can just go with the, this avd manager and just click on any device you will find the list of device and you will open it right and it have the all of the uh, feature of a mobile you have you can see that there is a chrome browser and roll right so we, here we can check the all features right so so now, uh, can I directly just run this localhost and 3000 port on my uh, Chrome browser in the address bar? Actually not. For that, first of all, we need to make a production build of our uh, React application. So just write here npm run build, right? And just run it. When you just run it, it will just uh, create optimized build and it have just remove all the extra code and all the extra node modules and uh, XYZ things so that it can be pure uh, a web app you can say that right so this is ready and now you just uh, need to run here serve as build command so just write here serve minus s build if serve is not installed in your system then just write here npm installed serve right and just write enter here now uh, it is saying that uh, our application is available on the local host as well as on the network so let's try to run it on the local host this is working fine that's great but can I just open this URL on the mobile let's try to open actually not we cannot just open this uh, uh, local host 500 URL here the reason is the local host can only understand by our uh, window operating system and Ubuntu operating system and all they cannot understand by the mobile right so how I can understand uh, to the mobile device for that we have to just go on uh, 10.0.22 and then port number and here you can see that we are able to access this screen otherwise you can just uh, directly jump on this IP also right so if you just want to go this IP just right here 192 and all and just here you can see that right so this is working in perfectly in the mobile you can see that uh, the data is also loading and about page home page everything is working fine that's great but now let's check the feature that I told you that uh, this application can be installed as a normal application here you can see that they have the loads of normal application so how can it be installed for that uh, most of the time you actually seen that uh, let's open this one when just open any flip card and any progressive web app you will just find the add to home screen option but for now we are not able to see this I will show you this thing how we can implement in the next video but for a moment uh, to access the uh, progressive web app as a normal mobile app you have to go inside the uh, corner and just click here on the three dots and let's go to add to home screen right and just put here any name to your uh, sorry just uh, your application like I just want to put here PWA demo right like this and just add to that one so it will just uh, adding uh, adding or you can say that it's just installing right 
now let's go to the home and you will find that there is a one PWA demo kind of application so when you just click on it or you will tap on it on a mobile you, you can see that this is coming on a full screen right like a normal mobile application right and you just go here uh, for the users you can just access the about you can access the home and all right and if you just disconnect your internet then uh, you will try to visit it then it will still think that you are in the offline mode as we are able to see on the normal uh, Ubuntu or Chrome browser right so let's uh, just again on the internet and this is working fine as a progressive web app right in the next video we will see that how we can add to home screen option or this is the officially word for this is how we can add the home screen banner right and after that we will see that how we can just change the color of this address bar and all right so don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel again bye bye take care